Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys a quick little tutorial. I feel like I always say quick little. Um, but it's going to be a tutorial on like a nice fall smoky eye. Um, I've been really into smoky eyes lately. So if you want to see how I achieve this smoky eye look, then Okay, just so what watching. we're going to do is start off with a flat um, makeup brush, eye brush. It's pretty flat, as you can see. Nothing too intense or special. Um, we're going to start off with the black, and the black is going to go on the eyelid. And that is going to be from the Tarte Calais Play palette, which is my favorite palette ever. And we're going to go in with the color black. This is called Onyx. And it's going to go right on the lid. Very dark. Fallout is really crazy, actually. <laughs> All right, this has to be fixed. I think I put too much. A little bit too much. Just a wee bit too much. Anytime you ever make a mistake, it can always be fixed with something. Just takes a lot of blending and a lot of patience to fix it, but nothing concealer and powder can't handle. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to use that same brush. Now, this is actually really pigmented. I have to be careful here. Okay. And there we have it. Black on the lids and brown. I always do brown in the crease. Gonna go in with the color stone just to blend all this out. Make everything really seamless. And this takes a lot of time and a lot of patience. You can use any brown that you want. I like to keep everything high. With the brown just because I don't want to overdo it with the black and everything. All right. Now I do need to add some form of a highlight because this is a very, very, very dark, intense look. So, I'm going to take, if I can find it, here we go, a pencil brush. I'm going to take the color beige from the Lorac Pro 2 palette, and I'm going to put this on the inner corners. Okay. 
the inner corner and then I'm also going to place this and my brow bone On camera, it looks so good and so bright. Oh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. All right, I'm going to keep the bottom lashes um pretty bare because i want to keep it just the top um today and i'm just gonna go in with some mascara for smoky eyes i like it to keep it pretty um simple fairly simple Mascara makes all the difference. Literally. And you always want to remember to keep the black very low. You don't want to put the black into the crease you don't want to put the black um anywhere it shouldn't be that's just gonna make you look like you got punched in the face which is why i like to keep the bottom lashes and the bottom lower lash line very bare and yeah there you have it folks this is my version of a fall smoky eye. Um, I've been loving doing this lately. It's just very fall, very festive, spooky, if you will. Um, there's really no other kind of technique for this. You just need to keep the black shadows very low. You don't want to bring them up into the crease because it's going to get too high in there. In there, you want to put like a brown, a good transition color to mix with the black. Um, but yeah, that is the final result this is my version of a small black smoky eye if you have any questions just leave them down in the comment section below i can answer your questions any day anytime um please don't forget to turn on notifications for when i post videos which is monday through friday and don't forget to subscribe before you leave i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in my next one bye